So we're over at the front of the course, not so far away from us. Well, you can see two lights in the distance. Cool. Um, so tonight we're at the top pool. We've done the middle pool quite a lot. Now we're at the top pool. Well, just walking around to it. Uh, this one's meant to be the worst one for accidents and drains and The most recent one I can tell you about is little boy lost his, his ball. His dad went to get it back and was unable to get back out and, and drown. So, you can just about see the pools. I think we're going to walk and try and get a bit closer. Yeah, the light is just ahead of us. Well, I was going to go around to that bit. You should have got that drip, drop there, drop there, isn't it? Yes. Drop. Hello, Lou. And you want to be able to just have a shot of Sue's backside? When did you not get a shot on my backside? I tried one. So, like I said, those of you who want to chat from other people's groups, please come and say hi. There's a going DW. Um, so yes, like we said, unfortunately, you know, a lot of potential of any orbage isn't going to happen because due to a lot of dirt on the floor and hot weather, it's going to cause a bit of kick off. So, uh, it's going to happen. And there you go, payback for John. I really don't like dark places. <laughs> Yeah, but you've got that one that always scoves, ain't you? Watch that dip. Why does it feel like it's bloody winter? I don't know. It's not bloody winter, but I'm still caught there. Watch that dip. I've just seen the dip. And just for a fair time, look, eh? Wait, watch that dip. Um, it's a yeah, big one. Remember, that's very interesting. Exactly. Yeah, it's all about paranormal unity. And that's the proof. Oh my god. Elephant. Frankie is all over the place. We've got a really 
bumpy to him right now. Yeah, don't forget there's ducks down there as well. That's why I haven't made it that quick. See what, pop it on the floor a sec. Let's see if we get the same. Okay. As you can see guys, we're getting some sort of action from the ramp pod, uh, the K2 meter. It is all the way down on the floor. with us now. Can you turn those lights off? Can you stop affecting them? What year got the year? Yeah. What have you got the year? Just me, uh, the SP11, as always. Might be worth using that. I will be in a bit. I'm trying to try something to get interaction with this. I might have my K2 with problem. Mm -hmm. uh, no, but I do know what I do have. Which is the amazing thanks to Steve. on the side is positioned, the sensor. Oh, uh, we can't set 
me step away. something up at a distance, it's got to be down here somewhere. Across the road. And there's nothing down there. No, it's got to get close. So we'll get rid of some grass here. Bones just slipped out of the cell just Can we set it off again? That's me. What's just knocked your phone over? What the hell just knocked your phone over? No, so I an idea, but they want to leave my phone alone. But okay, it's insured. We'll bring your phone around this side so you can get all shots. What, just in case I knock it over again? Yeah. No, 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 you're in the way. Yeah, I've just missed that one. Yeah. Sensor again. Just let you guys know at home. And I'm currently stood behind the camera. So if there is a spirit with us, you're interacting with the K2 meter. Mobile phones are far away from them. Can you set off the proximity sensor again? Well, I've got a bit of a wider shot there. Set the sensor off again, please. I mean, you had no harm. <coughs> yeah, they're out of respect. Sue's phone is all over there. Well, put this way. The K2 still sat there. Mm. That hasn't been knocked over. No. And my phone's heavier than that K2. Oh, yeah. That's why I said I can't. I don't understand it. Any comments, guys? Get it shared out as well if you can. That'd be absolutely fantastic. Awesome, good job. Oh, Willow. Did you decide to come back again? Can 
stand in front of it again. It's as if they're passing through, isn't it? Stopping and starting. Do you see it? It stops, starts, and it's now virtually disappeared. No, I can still see it. Just about. Where's it gone? Yeah, I can, I've got it, I've got it. It's gone behind the clouds. Right, there is no fucking clouds. I can see it. Where? But did you see how it kept stopping and starting? Oh. I wish I could bloody zoom in on this. You can't. Stream yard. Okay, so if you noticed on that, I hope you did. But there was a light in the sky that was just moving across very slowly. Kept stopping and starting. Right. And randomly just disappeared. Uh, our planes don't just disappear, do they? Mm. And am I right All in saying right, it's a clear arguing. noise? Yeah. So where the fuck did it go? No way! What? Jonathan Marcy turned around and said, John, them lights have been seen before. From when I was a child. So you're saying that Fence Pools is a UFO hotspot as well? Um, as you can see, Steve, it's not going off now. Uh, we, I, I tend to give everything a good clean out before I use it anyway. Um, that's been cleaned. And as you can see, it's not going off now. But at one point, it was just going off. You really can tell where that going off. So, Gianni Boy, are we saying that this is a UFO? Lots of people have seen them. Yeah, so for you, Steve. Watch this. Consider distance. Yeah. No, that didn't do it before when I come over here. John's 50. Oh, you see. There you go. It is, and Sue's just tested it out. Go across again. Yep, so, yep, hold. Mm. Steve's happy, he says, well, the sensor's working well, just like it's meant to. And I am more than, more than happy to promote your stuff as well, Steve. I know that you will, we will do more when it comes to it. I love this gadget, Steve. It's fucking amazing. And I did promise you, I would be using it a lot. Um, so the chances are, when I walk fast and it goes, there's someone actually walking past as well. So I've done it a 
Yo. So we've got REM pod going off, Kite 2 going off, power sensor going off. And I've got throws. And Same. the temperature has dropped. And to be quite honest, I've just lit the fire. Right, uh, Jonathan says that he was seeing them when he was 12, 13 years old. Right, okay. So it's got to be a good 40 years ago. There's a lot of there. My flame has been proof, it's just gone bright red. Oh. My flame's just gone bright red. Weird. But all these keep going off because of what we've just seen. Well, with UFO sighting slash abductions, one of the common things is, is electricals playing up somewhat fucking chronic. I can't explain this at all because we've got the power sensor going off. The K2 stuck on. K2 stuck, REM pod stuck. Well, according to Jonathan, he says that, that the fence pools is a strange place. Can I fucking believe it? I can't explain any of this, and there we've got geese going fucking ape shit. And I had a hunch to come here tonight. Okay, if you don't want us to be here, move away. Stop just in case anybody thinks I'm fake anything or whatever. I am a good way away. It's as if it's fucked up all the equipment. I don't get it. Yeah, no worries. Oh, can't wait to test out some more gadgets of yours, Steve. Trust me, mate, I'm loving your stuff. Yeah, no I worries, Steve. I so wish I had a red pod bear right now. You need to hurry up and write it Yeah, a little bit of sensory there, not really. This is fucked up, man. That's not a problem. What's that? He's going to be uh, building some more stuff for us. Um, it's like, so she goes, it's like real life stranger things. Oh, I don't know, man. You know what? I really want to say you know let's what? just pick up the stuff and go. No. Nah. Oh, my phone even flew on the floor. Do you know what? Just well. with this alone, I wouldn't even need the SB11, man. Ah, <laughs> go on. I don't even want to use it. Go on. I'll say do it, because I reckon them batteries have gone. Why do you want to pick that up then if them batteries are gone? I'm not sure if you're saying either a ghost or fucking angel. Oh, you got a freaking clue. Yeah. The batteries are drained. the batteries are red pod. And you only changed them not long ago. Yeah. Did you read 
So I'm not going to give any uh, audio paranoia where I will be telling you what I'm saying. Is this a hot spot for UFOs? There's also spirits here with us. Repeat myself. Is this a place, a hot spot for UFOs? the reason why my technology was going off. to explain if you want to see the rest of what's gone on head over to the other channel LSS and I'll see you next time